Okay, today's my English chat for TOEFL 2019, uh, October 2nd. I practice integrated speaking, three, reading, listening, of course, I uh, study a lot of vocabulary. So, uh, as for integrated speaking, three, reading part, yeah, it was a little bit dang dangerous, you mean, uh, a little bit. Uh, I didn't have a little time, but it was a little bit close, but I could read all the uh, sentences and passages and, re and realize what it was in the implications. And yeah, speaking part, uh, it was a little bit difficult for me. The listening part, it was very easy. It was easy, but the speaking part, it was a little bit difficult for me to speak, uh, speech, I mean talk, address, and time. The grammar was a little bit uh, strange, but anyway, I could well. I did well. And as we're reading, uh, I did two. I saw two passages. See me two questions, and one was great. Uh, I think it was good. It was ten out of thirteen, and I could uh, solve it in the time. It was great. Mm -hmm. uh, it was really not. I felt then it was not so difficult, but the other passage was difficult. I mean, <laughs> it. I, it took more than 20 minutes, and uh, what was worse, I, I I was I could solve like six out of 13. Like there, it was very ridiculous and stupid. I couldn't solve. Like there are many mistakes. Maybe, the, but I checked the answer, and it was a, a little bit close. But because the question I mistake is there is always like a choice like two choices left two cho two selection which is left and I chose the one I, I chose one and the other one was like a uh, uh, correct that situation is sometimes happens and it, like you I mean often happens and uh, I think I the pr the reason why I mistake a lot is, yeah, of course, my comprehension is not good because I have no, I have still few vocabularies. But, uh, but the main reason is, I, I, I think I guess or suspect too much. I mean, guess and I presume the sentences like I consider too much. So the answer must be like a more objective one. But the only fact in this uh, obtained from the sentences, but I always choose the answer, which is not like impl like what which is not mentioned, but can like imply like a, uh, yeah. I always chose the wrong uh, questions about like uh, I always chose some kind of implications, like uh, suggestions. Not a objective truth, so I gotta yeah I have to be careful about that. And listening part, yeah, and I also saw some lecture and uh, advising one, and yeah, this is still like my average is more than eighty percent. Is I think that is good, but sometimes it became very bad because yeah, there are questions that I even don't understand you mean I make no makes sense like I, I can't uh, agree like, there are sometimes difficult very difficult questions so I I give up those questions so they have to be thing so yeah I abandoned it abandoned it but anyway I want to retain the score about re listening and today I advised I made. I advised my father. You mean I give some advices to my father about the computer laptop. He has a problem about laptop computer, so he mailed. He he contact with me, and I thus I uh, gave some advices, and I, it looked it worked well. So I'm grateful about that. Yeah, the problem is, uh, anyway, I feel very tired. 
Yep, I'm very tired. Like my my motivation is getting worse. Like I feel very lonely, and I cannot decide my colleges. And once the co the goal or purpose is obscure, uh, I don't feel like doing something or committing. Yep. Like I uh, recently, I uh, lately I've been thinking like what I'm doing what why I'm doing this or what I what what I want to do or you know what happened to next what is my future I always think these things I'm like concerning about the future and that I think I know that's not good things but I cannot help doing I cannot help doing that you mean concerning feeling anxiety so I gotta have some consult or discuss some uh, yeah consult with someone or talk to someone yeah I need some medi <laughs> medical care yeah I also do some walking and exercising but you know, one of the reason is that I can't that I that I can't do running in the, uh, these days because uh, because I had a because I had a call, cold, because I had a fever. I'm not sure. I think I'm. I'm. I over. I've already recovered and restored, but I have still a lot of fever. So that's the reason too. That's the reason I. That that is the also. Yeah, that's the additional reason that I feel very like dismal and very melancholy. Anyway, tomorrow is the English class, so I gotta meet. I I can meet some people, and even a teacher. I can talk to someone, and I think talking to someone or com taking communication is a very good things. So I'm hoping my mental will restore. Yeah, <laughs> and that's all. So much for today. Thank you very much.